Welcome back to the Salvage Survival Series, where we can only build small grid blocks, large grid structural, and doors. Joining me is Fuzz, Dan, and occasionally other members of the Court of Fools. Enough talking, let's get to the episode. We might want to clear the um, uh, refineries so we can chug through some of these uh, scrap bits. Yeah, what the hell? Yeah. It, why did that get blown up first? Of course, okay, so it's trying to draw those first, which is stupid. Unless that's what I need to start it. It is not, I need a steel plate to start it. You got bastard. It's not like something just blew up from one of those little T-signals. I could not make out that. Something just blew up. Probably one of the unknown signals. Ah. Ah. Uh, I see what I've done here. At least I hope it was one of those. <laughs> not something more important. Two, three, four. And you still didn't grab any steel plates first. I need steel plates to put the thing down. Use your brain, space engineers. You got one. You got programmed with one. It's called AI. What happened, man? You disanswered it. It's called AI. <laughs> the build planner calls for a steel plate to put the item down first. You might want to pull steel plates first. Just saying. Damn it. <laughs> that seems to make sense to me. I don't know about y'all. Sorta. Of. Also, have we lost all the steel plates? I think we're out of steel plates. Yeah, I'm having to run over to Dano's rig. Alright. Did you use the ones in my Dropbox over here? I don't believe so. Uh, I must have. Will that be the case, I'm going to run the item over to Dano's. Since that would be easier than going back and forth. Question is, where do I go down? Know what we can do to get you off the. What, shoot him again? Nah, he's gonna pick me up. Oh, you had a nice one today. Just don't smooth my head. I'll do my best not to. I mean, you got a, a precision proboscis up there now. Yeah. I'm not going to risk that with my... Uh, I might have to risk that. Damn it. What? You got one of the tires. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm. You're actually not dragging me down like a second vehicle usually does. Mm. You realize this thing could flip out while I'm messing with pistons and oh yeah, block. oh yeah. Oh, that's a dangerous combination, anyway. I know. Now he's putting me near all these goodies that y'all found. Oh, you found them too. Okay, or you mean I'll this just stuff for me and D Swank? There you go. Yeah, I'm just keeping him hostage. speed up while I'm out here. Yeah. 
flip, 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 flip. There we go. Alright. That one. Can't pull from that one either. Well, that's completely useless. What? Can't pull from the dongle. Yeah, the dongle's been disconnected. The dongle's disconnected and empty. Unless someone put something in it, because I emptied it last time. After being chased by spiders the whole time. <laughs> But we are hurting for motors bad. Motors are over at the uh, base. Yeah. They're they're jacking all the motors that are needed for completing the uh, the the atmospheric engines. You told me build a scout ship. I'm building a freaking scout ship. Yeah, no, I I just figured you'd bi build something efficient. I am. Okay. All the thrusters require motors. <laughs> I last time we discussed this, you were building a a, a rover. Uh huh. Which still requires motors for the suspensions. Yeah, but not as much as thrusters. Nah, not as much as thrusters, no. <laughs> and I think I got stuck again. Damn it! Let's see if that is a 3x3, three three, so that's not. I'm gonna have to cut my nose back off. Place where my wheels go, I think. Uh. I think it pisses me off too much. I'm gonna paste the motherfucker in. Piston, piston, there we go. Paste on, paste on. Yeah, I think so. Small motors, computers. Can we grab some interior plates? Sixty-four or sixty-five k uranium ore. That's not bad. That should hold us for quite a while. Well, I had to stop because my I have two cargo containers which are stuffed full of ice, so I have to let those drain down a little bit before I dig out some more. Right.
Uh, Nano. Yo. Can I borrow your little, uh, three-engine fighter? I want to scout a couple things. Yeah. Just make sure it's got enough to set it. Uh, it's full on oh. hydrogen. So. Okay. Because I don't remember if we recharged the batteries after the last little, uh, go around. Yep, uh, that would have been a whole lot easier if I'd realized the air brakes were open, but since I couldn't see them... Have kind of a rough takeoff there, buddy? Yeah, but it's up in the air and nothing blew up, so... Ah, uh, that's good. that'll have ice. It's almost a two. So we've got another ice field. Smaller. Identified derelicts. That Sky Warden didn't have much on it. Okay. Alright. We're gonna hit those two. Unidentified Rex. Let's see what's over there. Take a look at the Kestrel. I think everything else is gone. And I don't think the Sky Wardens had any hydrogen uh, thrusters on it. I don't remember them being hydrogen on it. Pretty sure they were all out. Huh? Okay. Ooh, hello, lag. Something must have just popped in. They almost died from lag. That wasn't near me. If anything popped in. That's one thing, Dano. Your your little traveler has one yeah. hell of a glide profile. <laughs> yeah, actually works pretty well. Yeah. All right, uh, D Swank, when you get back, I'm gonna need you to do something crazy for me. Oh shit! Oh dear! <laughs> something crazy, he says. What? Give me a. Uh, put the first level on the uh, lift truck merge blocks. Ah. Ooh. Steel what plates the... and large steel tubes. What is this? I'm gonna give this a buzz. Okay, that's a supply. Huh? Okay, that's not really gonna. Okay, eight. Let's open those up. Oh, okay. Lands fairly easily.
that's never good. Okay, there, there's this thing I found. It's in the middle of the uh, the desert. It's supply cache. No unauthorized access. Okay. I. Uh, it's when I'm standing at it. It's beacon is 18 meters underground, and it has a button at the front door that says "feeling lucky?" question mark. Hmm. Push it and run. No, no time to run. <laughs> oh dear. Well, you're you're. I followed your instructions, Daniel, and your aircraft is out there, ten kilometers <laughs> from base. <laughs> Explosion or guns? Explosion. The whole thing's <laughs> gone. Uh. Oh, I locate the planet again. Alright, what did you need me to do, Fuzz? So... You should be able to find me. Okay. I need that on top of that. Okay. Save the world. Mm -hmm. Because this could go ugly very quickly. I would advise dropping it and not holding on to it while it's connecting. Uh -huh. yep. Well, that was less scary than I thought it was going to be. I'm still streaming. Have I let go? Uh, rise. No, you have not. Float down, you are down, it. let go. <laughs> now, have you let go? All right. Now I need to go to the pistons and share inertial tension. It's not terribly happy, but it's not bad. Okay. Hmm. I need gyros on it. That will help. No, yeah, you don't need gyros on a ground vehicle, but they help. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, like, subscribe, and all that other YouTube jazz. And there's a link to our Discord server in the description below. And until next time, bye!